Well, we're going to replace this Honeywell thermostat with a Nest version 2, two-stage thermostat. We're going to show you how that goes. Taking it out of the box and putting it on here. The breakers for the AC are already turned off. Here's the view outside of the box. Fairly small compared to the existing thermostat. Here's the back plate. Includes the bubble level and the push-in wires. Also comes with two back plates that we may need to use it depending on the size of the hole in the wall. So one back plate and a special screwdriver that looks like a normal screwdriver, modern version, with several bits in it, and some assorted screws for mounting. And we're going to peel off our labels and attach them to our existing wires. Got an R. Here's our R label. C. Our auxiliary heat. W. E. Y2, which is our second stage of cooling. OB. Green wire. Taking the old thermostat mounting screws out, it's ready to go. There's what we've got to work with. There was no sticker included for Y2, but the base plate does have a Y2 wire location, so we'll use that. Since we've got some holes here from a previous installation that the smaller nest won't cover up, we're going to use the included optional base plate here to mount it. Uh, looks like this should snap in. Okay. 
feed our wires through. And we'll just have to mark where we want it to go and put our screws in. I'll place it so the wire hole is right in the middle there. Use the bubble level to give it square. So that's good. Make sure we're still square. Alright, it's mounted. Alright, let's attach our wires. OB. Let's see how well these work. Not bad. C. G. Y1, all the way at the top left. Y2, which we didn't have a label for, but it's the only one that's unlabeled. Okay. Let's check that one. All right. R H. Our auxiliary heat, which is W2. And our E. Our E star, we'll put in the star. Alright, all our wires are connected. Flatten this out a little bit. <coughs> Not too bad. Alright, let's click this in and see what it looks like. I think we need to get these pretty flat. Right, I think we're in. Let's go turn the power on.
All right, power is on. Our nest is alive. We'll work on the setup next. All right, we've run through the setup and we're active. And we can adjust the uh, temperature. Looks like we get a little green indicator, kind of like a Prius or a RAV4. We'll let it get started. All right, took about 10 minutes, 15 minutes, including the network setup. Very nice so far. Boom.